Hey guys, it's Rob. I just wanted to do a follow-up video on uh, Beta Flight Release Candidate 6 just with uh, the air mode. And how I've got it set up at the moment is uh, motor stop enabled. I've got an idle up switch here. When I move it to the middle position, that's just idle up so the motors will start once the board is armed. And if I move it further up, it's got idle up and air mode enabled. So what I notice is that when I just move the quad around with the motors running, when it's in idle up, you can feel the flight controller resisting the movement or, or trying to stabilize. When it's in air mode, that is actually a lot more aggressive. So I can feel it's a much stronger stabilization effect. So just bear with me. The video will be a little bit sloppy because I don't have an assistant to help me. So I've just got two hands, but I'll do the best I can. So we've got the quad in my left hand. We'll just arm and enable idle up. So this is idle up only. If I move the quad, I can feel that it is trying to uh, stabilize and correct the movement. We'll just put air mode on. That's air mode on. The corrections are a lot more severe. That's air mode off, just with uh, idle up only. So it's uh, correcting, but a lot softer. To stop that. This time I'll flick it straight to air mode and idle up. Idle down. So I hope uh, you could see that. I certainly could feel it in my hand that just the basic idle up gives you um, flight controller response to any movement and when you've got air mode that corrective response is a lot more aggressive. Um, I haven't flown it like this, but I'll try and do that tomorrow. But I just wanted to shoot that quick video to give you a bit of an idea of what, what air mode does. Thanks for watching.